Senate will now come to order. The session will be open with prayer. Prayers will be offered by the chaplain of the Senate. Today's chaplain is the Reverend Chris Starr of the Mount Zion Baptist Church, Brogue, Pennsylvania. Please rise. Shall we pray? Our Father, we thank you today for who you are as creator. And Lord, thank you for making us. I want to thank you today for these public servants that have given their lives, Lord, to work for the people here in our commonwealth. And Lord, we thank you today for, Lord, uh, giving us freedom. And Lord, thank you for the privilege to live in the United States of America, Lord, the greatest country that in the world, Lord, that you've given us the freedom to be here today. And Lord, the health and Lord, the breath. And Lord, we know that every good gift that we have, that we've been given comes from you. You're the giver of good gifts. And Lord, today decisions will be made and Lord, debate will take place. And Lord, we ask for your wisdom. Lord, your word says that if we ask for wisdom, Lord, that you would give it. Lord, we understand that our biggest problems that we face today is our sins. And Lord, we thank you for sending your son, Jesus Christ, to die and to be buried and to rise again to pay for man's sin. Lord, I pray today as these men and women meet, Lord, that uh, Lord, they will understand that what they do is before you today. Lord, it's before the state of Pennsylvania and Lord, our citizens, but Lord, more importantly, it's before you. And Lord, I thank you for them. I pray, Lord, that you will guide their minds and their thoughts on this day in Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, Mr. President. Mr. President, I rise to introduce our guest chaplain, Pastor Chris Starr from the Mount Zion Baptist Church located in the Brogue. Pastor Starr began serving Mount Zion Baptist Church in 1999, and after 14 years serving as his father's assistant pastor, Pastor Starr became Mount Zion's senior pastor in 2013. Supporting over 60 ministries around the world, Mount Zion Baptist Church shares their message, the gospel of Jesus Thank Christ, you. near and far. Thank you, Pastor Starr, for your congregation's prayers, uplifting all the members of the General Assembly, and for today, delivering such a thoughtful prayer at the start of our session week. Seated in the gallery are guests of Pastor Starr. Joining us today are his wife, Jenny, his daughter, Alyssa, and their friends and members of the Mount Zion congregation, the Haywoods, Eric Sr. and Eric Jr. Would my colleagues please join me in a warm Senate welcome for Pastor Starr and his guests. Thank you, Mr. President. Please stand. 